And I'll just leave it in because this, this is actually kind of important. And because I need to get this. <laughs> Take the super force metal. Because actually, this is actually kind of important that I need to do. Also, I think I should do this. No, I'll do it in a minute. Uh, I'm not going to do it just yet. Uh, I forgot where it was. Oh, yeah, it's up here. I forgot. I forget shit. <laughs> it turns out we have to get two very important things right now, and one of them is here in the Melda Ore plant. So, we're here. We go inside the Melda Ore plant. And this opens that door that's over there. This red door over here with the mouth of key, we open it. Find some pretty cool stuff here, some figure tokens, so I'll be back to get those in a minute. All right, and here we have one of the other deployments here, Meltdown. Good thing we came here. Now for here, I wanna install and change some stuff. I'm gonna put the Let's see, where is it? The Ice Buster MK2 and uh, the Ice Saber on zero. I need to put these. Just trust me, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Keep on going and what the heck is that thing? What the heck is that guy doing there? <laughs> What's he doing there? I mean, it's so weird. There's just some kind of enemy there. Duck Bill Mole. Ha 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 ha. What do you want? Well, wait, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Duck Bill Mole, and the hot means of the cattle and cable. It didn't talk. It's a, just a ball, and you're talking to a ball. Wow. Just wow. And you are. You're here to steal my treasure, the treasure that Rellin gave me. We can't have it. You'll have to face the crazy animal now with the first. Yeah, uh, I guess I should have mentioned this. Ready to tangle with Duckville Moore. Uh, it's chilled by the cold. Oh, um, these guys heal energy using ultra fires. Uh oh. It's Maximo Steam again. <laughs> okay, now. This is Duck Bill Mole, or the two of them. Each, both of them have the same stats, same life energy, it's just the same. These are Duck Bill Moles, or how I like, but for me, I like to say that they're like, hey look, they're Perry the Platypus. Nah, I'm kidding. Anyway, um, life energy 58,000, it's the highest we've seen yet. Power 155, ouch, that's pretty high. Armor 65, shield 75, and speed 80. These guys are tough. Literally, they're very tough if you don't know what to do. Now, to beat these things, there are two strategies. You can either, they're weak to fire. These guys are very weak to fire, so it makes them not that hard to kill. However, they heal some things. So what you have to do is, I would take one at a time. I would not kill both of them at the same time. You can choose which one you want to kill, and they drop the same exact items, same exact thing, and they drop power charges and bigger turrets, which is nice. And, but they have very powerful attacks, and they're very dangerous, and I you have to be level 30 for this, and I'm level 25, so... I'm underleveled for this, so I'm kind of scared. <laughs> anyway, let's give it a shot and see what we can do. And... Just be sure to let, not let them heal. If you let them heal, you're pretty much dead meat, so... Be sure to watch what you're doing. And remember to kill one at a time. Don't kill, don't kill them both at the same time. If you do that, you're kind of doing a very bad move there. They charge flame energy, and they have. Uh oh. Yeah, they have too much attack power for that. So you got to be very careful. Transform. So be sure to come prepared for this fight and be sure to use the waters. But I'd rather use the water and ice attacks to beat them because you no, know, they do get really tough and it's 
really takes a lot longer and I'm trying to do these fights fast since I don't have that much room in my video camera and I wanted to do these before it was too late. So, yeah. Be sure to use silver horn. You can attack them both. Just be careful not to let them up to heal at the same time because it can be a little bit of a pain in the ass. So, they have very strong attack power so just be careful what you're doing. Be very, very careful. And be sure to know what enemy you're, you're defeating. See how much HP they have? Holy crap. I mean, seriously. Ah, this theme is awesome. So don't attack them both, you just gotta choose one. Just use whatever you feel comfortable with, except your slash. Your slash, I still think is shit. I just pressed it by mistake because it happened, because shit happens. <laughs> 17,000, not bad. Except I think he's gonna heal, which is a bad sign. The good is that they only heal a little, but it's still a very bad sign, though. Ah, shit. Ha ha, idiot. It's because their attacks are so freaking high. My gosh. With their attacks so freaking high, they're very hard to beat. And X is down, so I gotta revive him. Let's see, let's see. Reboots, I've got four. A lot. I'm gonna heal, so I'm gonna do that. Does it seem like the best move for now is to heal? At least for now it is. <laughs> I know Axel's already fully healed, but it's best to do this for now. <laughs> now actually, some people actually use the whole bait strategy for this. I don't like to do it. The reason I don't use a bait strategy for this is because I don't like to be cheap. I only use it to be using for certain enemies, and it's just the way I play the game. Respect it to these. Just keep on doing the silver horn strategy, the water ice strategy, blah blah blah. Same strategies over and over again. And I just like this theme. This theme is great. I don't know why they keep on putting it, but it's still a great theme. Whatever you do, do not attack with X as normal attack. If no, it will heal them. Not a good idea. Very not a good idea. Yeah, you got bulldozed, all right. Luckily, he won't. Heal. They only heal very little, so that's a good thing. The bad is that. They have very high attack and it's very dangerous. So, yeah. All I can do is hope they can kill him because actually both X and Zero are very weak. Because with two of them there, it's very this fight can be very difficult. Once you kill one of them, it's not so bad and I kind of screwed it up in case. What did I just do? Ah, shit! I messed it up! Shit! Crap! I messed it up! Crap, crap, crap! Uh... Shit. I messed it up. My bad. I used the wrong moves. I'm sorry. I forgot. X that came... I completely forgot. I'm sorry. I completely messed it up. I'm sorry. I I still need to get used to this kind of a little better. 
Oh, well, at least I did good on that one. I'm still trying to get used to this. I kind of forgot X can't can't really use um, that. I forgot. Uh, my bad. I should have paid more attention to that. Oh well. Oh well. It was a minor mess up. I mess up a lot. I do that. But oh well. Let's see if I recover with this. Well, I recovered good, but it was still not enough for a final, for a final strike, so... I'm not gonna bother with that. Ha, <laughs> <laughs> he got bulldozed. Well, he's only one on heals him, so I guess that's not a bad sign. No! Axel, I forgot he was low on health. Shit. Uh. I can't risk losing Axel right now, so. Screw it, I'm using a reboot. Let's see. Uh, I don't think Axel's gonna survive that. No, he didn't. Shit. I'm not sure what to do here. Let's see. Next off, X can't survive this one, so I think what I'm gonna do is um. Oh, I know what I'm gonna do. I know what I'm gonna do. I'm going to no, I no, no. I just don't know. I don't know what to do. You know what? Uh, screw it. I'm healing. And then I'll revive Axel in a minute, and then I'll heal him. That's what I'll do. Ready for this? Ugh, they take so much damage. It's so risky. It's so risky what to do. Here goes so I'm kind of afraid to mess it up. This, this is not one of the fights I can do best, but... I don't think I suck at this fight. I mean, I'm not. I just messed it up somewhere by mistake. I'll admit I did, so. My bad. Anyway, let's just try to kill this douchebag. Oh, well, that's one down. Huh. And now, at least his defense is lower now, so. Let's revive Axel because you, we need you, dude. You need to be alive. Gotta fight. Now I'm healing everyone. All right. Ready for this? Oh. Ooh, ow! That was a really strong move. Transform. All right. Now that there's only one left, this is actually going to be a whole lot easier, which is good, because. I can't handle having to handle two of them. With two of them, it's really hard, so. It gets really annoying after a while. Again, same strategy. Just keep on attacking like this. And since his shield is much lower now, it makes him so much easier to beat. Which is swell. Literally. Let, let's hope, let's see if we can defeat this thing on time. But actually it's a lot easier since his shield is broken, so he's a lot easier, so the second one's a lot easier to defeat. So I always try to defeat one at a time, it's a better strategy than having to defeat like three of them, I mean both of them at the same time. If we use both of them at the same time, they're just gonna heal and it's gonna be a pain and then it's like, ugh, please just stop healing yourself, stop healing yourself, stop healing yourself. The strategy I used to use before was that, um... The strategy I used to use before was that I used to, um, not use any of the water or ice attacks at all. Back 
So what I would always do is always attack using full power, full power of everything attacking one at a time, which is a very bad idea. I don't seriously don't do it. It was a very bad idea I did. So just do what you do best. Kick ass. That's all I can really say. Because at least if you, if you attack them all the time, they heal, but don't heal all the time, so it's not a totally bad thing. And I'm out of hyper mode, just both act on zero, so I can just... Oh, I missed! What? I missed. How did that happen? <laughs> oh, well, I guess you can't really say anything about it, so... I just need to check something. It's a human. It's a human. Okay. Well, that's weird. Anyway. It's not gonna kill it, but it's gonna, like, lower it enough for us to be able to attack it more. Man, that took a lot of damage. Anything steal? Yes. All right, can you type once again? I forgot. So I'll just have to attack with what I've got. Oh, at least this is helping me gain some more power. So this is nice. Not perfect, but good enough. Nah, you're just healing like an idiot. I still have natural fire, sweet! Just don't use any fire attacks and you're fine. You can beat these guys pretty easily if you don't use... Well, not easily. These guys are still pretty... Really hard to beat. But, you know what I mean. Like, they're not too hard, You're, they're not like that, they're not the, they're optional bosses, it's an optional boss, you don't have to beat this guy to beat the game, I think. But I would try and go for it, because this game can be really hard if you, if you don't try this. Oh no. That ain't good, that ain't good at all. So, um, yeah, um, alright, alright, I'm gonna try to steal the item with, and I'm trying to revive, because actually I'm kind of in trouble here, I think I should have, I think I am in trouble here, oh, maybe not, okay, let's heal, because everyone needs it, oh my gosh, I ever used a lot, <laughs> I guess I, I guess I shouldn't have done this under leveled. <laughs> I'm just doing this under leveled to try this for fun. Any healing, fine, whatever. Because now his fire attacks are even more powerful because of this, so it makes him more difficult to beat. So. Not sure how to respond to that. <laughs> just saying. Oh, almost, but not quite. Not quite. Ah! That's gonna kill me. Oh, maybe it didn't. Okay, I got lucky there. I died. There. It's gone. Gee, that, that guy took a while. But now this one, you don't get any of those, um... Extras or whatever. Oh look, Cinnamon can now do 80%. Sweet. Now here you get probably one of the best items in the game. Absolute zero. This I'll be showing in a little bit. It's actually another one of Zero's hyper modes. That's what it is. A very good thing, actually. It's one of the best abilities I've ever seen and more cutting. Okay, so 
I'm actually gonna go heal right back, so and then I'm gonna come back here and go to the next one. So I'm gonna meet you guys back here in a little bit.